Oh, hi. Hi, today is the last day of school. What do you feel about that? Hmm, I feel good. You're happy too? Yeah. No, Emma yeah. wants to stay in school forever and ever. Mm -hmm. Because? Because it's been my favorite grade. The first day of school is totally different than the last day of school because I am not up and doing your hair and making you breakfast and being all peppy. I'm peppy. You're peppy? Yeah. Peppy. You're peppy? <laughs> I think you're just excited to be done with school. And what are your plans for the summer? Uh, St. Anthony. Yellowstone. Yellowstone. I know. Eat a thousand gummy bears in one hour. That is Emma's only wish is to eat a thousand gummy bears in one hour. Let's make it happen, Captain. All right, as per tradition, we are waving to them through the window for the last time. Lucy and I have done this every day this school year. And she's kind of grumpy this morning. Goodbye, kids. The kids are off to school, Lucy. Would you look at this? I did not even get a picture of the kids this morning before they left for their last day of school. I had this whole envision for the last day of school. I was going to go buy water balloons and fun popsicles, and I was going to make it really fun for when they came home from school today. And to be honest, I really just don't feel very well. Like my tummy kind of hurts and I'm tired. Like I just don't feel very good. So it's just a basic every day, except for they don't have school tomorrow. And I will charge up their RC cars so that they can play with these outside when they come home with like some neighbor friends. They do have a few Otter Pops that are trying to freeze up in the freezer. <laughs> I have to share this with you. I posted on Instagram a picture of Lucy. She's been throwing tantrums and so many of you are like, you're such a patient mom. You're so loving. You're so kind. Well, just now Lucy was whining and I go, Lucy, stop whining. Like I got mad at her and she, it was so cute. It was really cute actually. She goes, she goes, oh, sorry, mama, I'm sorry. Did you say sorry? Mm -hmm. Sometimes the kids just need to hear it in a stern voice. Mm -hmm. huh. And guess what? Mm -hmm. It worked. You said sorry and you stopped whining. It was wonderful. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is exciting. There are so many happy kids right now. That is an old fire truck. Oh, You're so all what? Dramatic. So dramatic? So sad. Why are you so sad? I never gonna see my friends again. You're never gonna see your friends again? I have a balloon with all my friends' names. Oh, that's so cute. That is a good idea. Jude signed it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're gonna be sad that you don't get to see him anymore. You know what? No. Oh, I, oh, just everyone. <laughs> Did you have a fun time? Yeah. Is it officially summer vacation? Yeah. No. I'm so hot. <laughs> oh, your reactions. Okay, let's go home and get another pop. Go put it. Somebody has to have some energy to take care of these crazy kids. I know, I'm like, how am I going to do this all summer? 
Yeah. We love our kids. We have so much stuff planned too. It's going to exhaust me. This baby better not come early. Were you sick yesterday, honey? Yeah. And you took a three hour nap? I think I got that from her. She had a tummy bug yesterday and took a really long nap. Well, yeah. let's let mom take That's a really long feeling. nap. Come on, sister. Should I kick you out of the room and say, leave me alone? <laughs> no, that's that what Lucy what does. <laughs> Come on, Lucy. Well, I'm sure Mom already talked to you, but how was your last day of school? Good. That's awesome. We have to do something fun on the last day of school. What do you want to do? Hi. Well, we got to get it open. Hi. Should we do it? Let's do it. Let's do it. It's probably going to take a lot of work. We probably will get it prepped today, but won't actually get to swim in until tomorrow because we have to fill it up with more water, we have to get the chemical balance right. So let's prep it today, and then tomorrow we can swim in it. How's that? Awesome. That's not fun for the last day of school. Fun for the last day of school. It's not fun we're working. Well, it's gonna be work to play, and it'll be fun. It's fun to do that type of stuff. To get your pool ready, that's fun. So this is what happens when Julie takes naps. Dad's in charge, and things just go however we want them to go. Dad, why would you hold for you? You what? You want to help me? Mm -hmm. Okay. The first step here is to get the ucky mucky algae water off the top of the cover and then we can get working. I know there's a more efficient way to do this. There's got to be. Okay, I think we're ready to take the tarp off. Do you think it's gonna be all yucky and green inside or do you think it's gonna be nice and blue just like we left it last summer? Nice and blue, nice and blue. Nice. I, I hope you're right. Last this, summer was a little bit of a challenge. Look, this is blue. Yeah, okay. Let's take this tarp off and see what it looks like. Uh, Fingers oh. crossed it's not completely yeah. nasty. That was about as fun as, I don't know what. That smelt disgusting. I'm covered in algae and gunk. <sighs> Whose idea was it to have a pool anyway? Not mine. I don't know, this is a ton of work and this is gross. Even with a nap, I think Landon chose the worst day to set up a pool. Sure, it's fun to set up a pool when the kids are like done with school, but I have been useless. Like I do something and then I'm like, I have to sit down, I'm tired. It is a huge job, isn't it? Like, unexpectedly big. The previous owners were like, you're gonna love a pool. It's like super easy. You just like pull that cover off and it's the same color and it's just ready to go for the next year. They were like, liars! Not a chance. This is so much work. But we'll get it there. Ice cream on a hot dog! 